Steve Ward here with Mercedes-Benz of Linden. I want to talk about Sprinters today. We've got a great selection of new and pre-owned uh, Sprinters here. In fact, we've got this uh, used motorhome right here. Uh, you can see this official uh, vehicle down here from, uh, I believe, uh, one of the tennis tournaments uh, that Mercedes uh, sponsored. We've got the worker uh, van here, uh, pretty much a stripped down version, ready for you to uh, put your uh, toolboxes in there, your uh, uh, you know, shelving, every, everything you might need. You can see that starts at 32495 uh, beautiful selection of Sprinters. Uh, I do want to highlight uh, one in particular today, and that is the 4x4 Sprinter. So you can see here, when I'm looking at the, the two vehicles, you can look at the, the distance from the top of the tire up to into the wheel well there, or the edge of the fender uh, flare right there. And you can see here on the left, this is the 4x4 Sprinter. It does have more ground clearance. It has uh, a low and high range. It's a true 4x4 four, uh, four four system. We'll pull it out, uh, start it up for you. Look at the ins and outs. Uh, you know, when you look at the inside of the Sprinter, it's going to look pretty much the same. Same liner, same seat options. Uh, there is, um, uh, you can see this one is a, uh, uh, what we'd call a crew van. So uh, it's, it's also ready for uh, some great weekend adventures. You could put some dirt bikes in here. You could put some, uh, some bikes, some camping equipment, rafting equipment. Uh, you can see right here we can pull this seat out as well. But this gives you a nice um, uh, setup as far as uh, getting uh, five people in the vehicle. Uh, plus all your uh, fun summertime or wintertime gear here in Utah. Pretty versatile in what we can do uh, year-round. Uh, but great, great vehicle dressed up in the 4x4. Uh, you can see, again, um, lots of ground clearance here. Let's jump in, start it up. Let's pull this uh, this Maroney sticker here. Uh, just as, as kind of a note here, so this is the 144 wheelbase. It's the uh, standard um, uh, height configuration. Now right here you can see the low and, and high range 4x4 package. And uh, we're paying $6,800 for that. So here's our base price. Um, or, uh, yeah, so it was suggested as a base price. Um, we add these options on here. We get a 49449 uh, price on the vehicle. Another thing you're going to notice here is the six cylinder uh, uh, engine. Set that back there. Uh, when we take a, a view from the front back here, you'll notice that this model does not have the air conditioning unit. So we'll be relying on the uh, on the air conditioning and heat from the front. Great uh, vehicle to start off as a base um, for your uh, custom modifications and your fun adventures. Or if you're going to work in this vehicle, what a great uh, vehicle to. Uh, you know, put some tools in there and get your crew in here and get off to the job site. Uh, you'll notice the nice pockets up here. Uh, seats are very comfortable. Uh, we can, uh, you know, get them high, you know, raise them up and, and lower them down and, and uh, move them. And they're, I mean, they're pretty versatile. Uh, another thing you're going to notice here in the 4x4 is these grab handles. Because of the fact that we've got a little more distance that we're climbing into the vehicle, I'll go ahead and uh, taxi out here just a little bit. Oh, I gotta, I gotta put it in gear for, for real. Up here, notice the uh, the audio. Uh, you'll have Bluetooth streaming phone. You also have um, Bluetooth streaming audio as well.
fun vehicles to drive. Uh, uh, the visibility is fantastic. The diesel engine performs exceptionally well uh, with great fuel mileage. Handbrake right here. Put the seat below. We'll just kind of run it down the road here for a second. It's fun to finally have a 4x4 in this vehicle. Uh, you know, we've got a lot of people that have cabins. They want to get in the backwoods. Uh, and this is a very capable vehicle to get you back there and uh, you know, through some deep snow and rough roads. Again, visibility really good. Uh, this doesn't have all of the windows. The other thing that you'll really notice is the uh, the ability that these things turn. Look at this. I'm turning around basically in my own uh, length. It's one thing that uh, people uh, really uh, notice right away with these vehicles. Lots of torque. Great pickup in these things. relatively quiet. I invite you to come down, take it for a ride, check out the new 4x4 system. I really can't tell much difference between the 4x4 uh, as far as the, the way it drives. You can see how well it turned around uh, with the four-wheel drive system. I'm very impressed with it. Uh, it doesn't ride any rougher than our standard uh, unit. Again, nice to have the grab handle right here. Uh, it is a little bit of a step. Some nice aggressive tires on there. Let's see the 4x4 uh, insignia there. I kind of like this color. I like it. Nice rugged looking uh, vehicle, fun to drive, smooth, quiet, diesel powered. Come down and take it for a ride. My name is Steve with Mercedes-Benz of Linden. We'd be happy, uh, any of our sales professionals here in Linden would be happy to show off this vehicle or any other fine products here at the dealership located at exit 273 in Linden. Of course, we will be uh, uh, moving to our new location here uh, well, within the next year. Uh, it will be Mercedes-Benz of Draper. 114th South. Mercedes Benz of Linden, 801 4400. 4x4 Sprinter.